Que onda, way? Welcome to this player growth test where I would take a look at Leandro Paredes. The 22-year-old center defense in Medus has a 76 overall. Some really uh, well-rounded stats from the start, physically, mentally, and technically. So it'll be interesting to see how he grows over the years. Uh, he's a 5'11 center defense mid slash center mid. He's right foot with medium medium work rates, 4-star weak foot, 4-star skill moves. So those, uh, that weak foot and skill moves can definitely come in handy. Uh, he can certainly play a little bit higher up the pitch as a center mid also. It'd be a nice little box-to-box -box midfielder. But uh, agility, balance, acceleration, stamina are all very solid from the starts. Uh, Sprinting strength strength are not too bad either. Strength will be definitely be one of the stats that improves over the years and mentally and technically very solid also. And you'll see him improve uh, pretty steadily at the end of that first season. Up to the 78 overall, some good improvement to the, the strength, uh, stamina, ball control also going up quite a bit and mental stats getting some improvements here and there is good to see also. So uh, it's really an ideal two-way midfielder in my opinion as he's at 87 ball control, 86 short passing. The 78 long passing is nice and uh, his tackling is very very good with a stand tackle at 75, 77 slide tackle. His marking is at the 69 here uh, at age 24, so pretty solid growth all around. He's an ideal box-to-box -box type midfielder. Because he is in the center, listed as a center mid, he doesn't get the big finishing growth, uh, but I like how well running he looks. Uh, could definitely play in other spots other than chest A, you know, center defensive mid or center mid also, but uh, you can see that agility and dribbling coming into play, finding that space, uh, then playing a wonderful pass over the top, just stretching the defense, can get in those interceptions as you can see in that highlight also. Uh, can really push forward, uh, play some good passes over the top, uh, as you see before. Good long passing, pretty good short passing also. Uh, I didn't get to use the short passing as much um, because I never played him as a cam or anything. So uh, I actually think he could fit that role maybe even uh, with the weak foot and skill moves he has. Uh, but I just never uh, give it a try because I had other players who could you know, fit in as a cam also. That was testing at the same time. But uh, he saw him win the ball back, push forward, use that ball control dribbling, setting up attacks, looking very good. Um, and and just very solid stats all around. As you can see now, this is a wonderful through ball. Perfectly weighted through uh, to create a little bit of a half chance there. As you can see him again, winning the ball, pushing forward again. That's just the kind of play he brings to you, um, whether he's playing as a center mid or a center defensive mid. But you could also uh, play a few other positions, which you'll see in his calculations. So 83 at age 26. Reached 83 at age 25 also, but he got a couple improvements. Uh, you know, slight improvements in some areas. So I decided to just show it now at age 26. But uh, take a look at the play information again for you guys and we'll take a look at his specialties also so he has the playmaker especially because of the vision so glad to actually see someone have that because mental stats are not growing much at all so some players are not getting that uh, but uh, 82 as a center attacking mid 82 as a right mid left mid 83 as a center mid 81 as a fullback and even 83 as a wing back so uh, he can play as a fullback and wing back also and contribute in those areas and uh, because of that crossing very good passing solid tackling just so well rounded the mix of uh, you know a Jody balance good acceleration high stamina, decent strength, mental stats, and again, the ball control, uh, dribbling being very solid, crossing, good passing, and some nice tackling also. So, a wonderful two-way type of player could contribute even as a cam also because of the weak foot and skill moves he has. Uh, so, just gives you a variety of options of where to play him. It's definitely up to you guys where you see him best fit as he can play anywhere from fullback, center defense, mid, center mid, even out wide a little bit, uh, and as a cam. So, a huge recommendation here, guys. I definitely would take a look at him. But with that, thanks for tuning in. I'll be signing out now, and I'll catch you guys later.